Welcome to video 39 in series 3 and in this video I'm going to implement being able to go to the menu scene. Okay, make sure you're in the game scene, so this is my GTGD S3 scene, that's what I called it. I'll write a new script and I'll call it game manager go to menu scene. Alright, and I'll just I'll, I'll attach it pretty quickly. Open it up, as usual. Namespace. I'll just have one variable. It'll be of the type game manager master. So game manager master. There it is. Game Manager Master. Alright, I don't need the start and update methods. Instead, I'll have void on enable and void on disable. Void set initial references and void go to menu scene all right uh, so first of all i'll just set the reference game manager master just get component game manager master all right call it here set initial references then i'll also subscribe uh, to the event go to menu scene uh, so I'll say game manager master dot uh, event. So go to menu scene event plus equals the go to menu scene method. Just copy that, paste here, unsubscribe, and inside of here I'll do application dot load level, and that level is index zero. That's the menu scene. Uh, okay, so that should do just fine. Uh, so going back here, now nothing's going to happen because I'm not calling the go to menu scene event anywhere. I need to do that on the button itself. So if you remember, uh, it's this button here, the main menu. So anyway, I don't need it enable to do this. I'll just go over to it. Button main menu. I'll just give it something to call. Drop in the game manager here. And which method is it going to be? It's going to be from the master script. And it's going to be call event go to menu scene. All right. Uh, so that should be enough. So if I hit play, it's there. If I hit the button, it worked. So it's gone to the menu scene. If I hit play game, it's back here in the game scene. So yep, that's pretty good. Uh, I'd say that's working nicely. All right. So that's it for this video. Uh, thanks for watching and keep going onwards.